And the Steelers go down three goals to two to the Newcastle Vipers to discuss the game. Joined by head coach David Matsas. And first of all, Dave, just your general views about the night. Um, you know what? It's a frustrating time right now for us, Simsy. Let's be honest. I mean, we uh, we can't figure out a way to win. And last year, that's all we we knew how to do. Um, you know, I thought uh, tonight they played a pretty simple road game. Uh, I thought we played, you know, aggressive. We didn't give up a whole lot of uh, a whole lot of ice to them tonight. And you know, you don't shoot a team 58-31. You expect to see more than two go in. Yeah. Uh, you know, tonight it was posting out, posting out, and you know it's 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 uh, it is frustrating. But you know, it is one of those things where you can't just keep throwing excuses out. It's just it's got to be addressed. It's got to be turned, and that's got to happen quick. Michelle Robinson played a great game tonight, but it seems that we've been punished at the other end for every single mistake that we make. Uh, yeah. Mistake first period, goal. Mistake second, goal. Mistake third, goal. It's, yeah. it's uh, tough times. So I, I guess you just, you just don't make mistakes, then, huh? Well, that's a <laughs> trick. <laughs> Problem solved. You know? Yeah, I got <laughs> But, you know, it's, again, like, it was one of those things where I didn't think we gave up a whole lot defensively. We gave up a power play goal, and, um, you know, uh, you know that goal at the end there, it, it, it is a mistake. It shouldn't happen. Uh, you know, we adjusted the face-off accordingly, and we just didn't get it done. Um, and, that, and that's the fine line that we're crossing right now is last year we, we did get it done. You talked before about those games of inches yeah. and at the moment it's just the flip side of it, isn't it? it? Is, yeah. And again though, it's gonna, it is one of those things where we got to find the other side or else, uh, you know, all of us are walking on inches. Yeah. Most people who are going to be watching this, it's Saturday morning and <clears throat> in a couple of hours time you'll be heading down to the NIC. Not the kind of place you want to go when you've got no confidence and you've got a locker room right now that hasn't really got any confidence. No, no, you can see it. I mean, I, I thought the guys did a good job tonight responding, uh, you know, after we went down 2-1. Uh, you know, and we took momentum, didn't we? Every yeah, time we yeah. got it back, it looked yeah. like we were going to go on to win it. Even in the second period, you know, we, we gave up momentum. Uh, we got we had some guys stuck out there for a, few, uh, for a long shift. We gave up, uh, you know, three or four minutes in the second where, you know, I think at the seven-minute mark, I looked up, and that's when we swayed it back in our favor and finished off the period in, in good form. Um, so there were were times where you give it up but you get it back and you're not going to control the play for 60 minutes let's be honest but we did a good job climbing back and getting the momentum that that we were carrying but uh again like it's you know we say it's a game of inches and we're seeing that right now mm -hmm. we were an inch on the side a lot last year uh, on the winning side now we're, we're inches on the losing side but you know the the loss column is is too strong right now uh we got to start putting wins up or you said, you said a couple of weeks ago if these guys couldn't do it, you'd find some guys that would. Is that still something that's in your mind, that if things don't get better and get better quickly, that perhaps personal change is something that's on your mind? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I mean, oh, I don't think so. I know so. I mean, the minute that we started searching, uh, we ended up with Hummy and, and Woody and Burns. The minute, the minute you start searching, uh, it's kind of an open pipeline for the agent world, you know. And right now the agencies are, you now emails, emails are coming in and, you know, texts phone calls, everything's coming through with, with an abundance of players. Uh, make no mistake about it, uh, you know, I'd be a fool not to entertain some of the, the, the uh, resumes that are coming through. I think this weekend uh, and tomorrow is such a big night for, for our team and our players. Um, you know, you, you never want to see that. You, you want guys to succeed, you want guys to, to, to play well and, and to win and th that's the one thing in Sheffield we all know that will secure jobs. But when that's not happening, jobs on, no, the yeah, jobs on the line. Jobs on the line, says Coach David Matzos. Steelers go down 3-2 to, to the Newcastle Vipers. Can only get better in Nottingham, can't it?